Hello, CA Hoops fans. Welcome back. He is Rob Washburn. I am Bobby Broyles. As we continue to count down the days to the start of the college basketball season with our CA Hoops weekly season preview powered by Under Armour. Rob, we begin today on the men's side with this year's preseason favorite, the Northeastern Huskies. Yeah, Northeastern has all the pieces in place to make a run in its first CA championship this season. The Huskies returned five of their top six scores from last year's team. They advanced to the semifinals of the CA tournament, and most of those players have been together for a couple of seasons now. Now, leading the group of returnees is senior forward Scott Efferton, who quickly became one of the top players in the CAA in his first season with the Huskies. He averaged 16 points and over 10 rebounds per game, recorded 19 double-doubles, led the conference with 57 block shots, and was named to the All-CA second team, as well as being the CAA Defensive Player of the Year. Now, if he can duplicate those numbers again this season, Northeastern should be in position to win a CAA title. Like we said, Coach Cohen's team was selected to win this year's conference championship in the predicted order of finish. One piece they missed greatly from last year's squad, Rob, was Quincy Ford. Yeah, Quincy Ford averaged 12 points and 6 rebounds per game and was an all-CA performer as a sophomore, and his season-ending back injury was a big blow to the Huskies. At 6'8", he has the ability to get to the basket, but he can also step out and knock down three-pointers. From all reports, he's fully healed and ready to go. Now, his presence should free up some other talented players. Junior guard David Walker averaged 11 points per game and made the all-defensive team last year, while freshman point guard T.J. Williams was a member of the all rookie squad. The Huskies also welcome back three-year starter Reggie Spencer in the post and have junior Zach Stahl returning off the bench where he contributes both as a scorer and a rebounder. We caught up with head coach Bill Cohen at Media Day and this is what he had to say about the return of Quincy Ford. Uh, absolutely. He, Quincy is doing uh, so well right now. Uh, he actually was started to feel the effects of that back at the end of his sophomore year. Uh, tried to manage it throughout the summer and you know it became apparent early in this that next year that he wasn't going to be able to do that for the entire year we opted for the surgery and geez he's just done wonderfully with it um, I think this is the best he's ever been uh, I think the CA is going to see the best version of, uh, of Quincy Ford and we're, we're, we couldn't be happier or more excited about it now as we take a look at the Northeastern women's team we welcome back Kelly McCarthy Daniel LaForce spent the past eight seasons with the Huskies and really turned the program around. She has moved on to be the head coach at Rhode Island, and here comes Kelly Cole, a very experienced assistant coach, getting her first crack at being a head coach at the Division I level, and Husky Nation seemed to be very excited to have her lead this team. Well, the first thing you need to know about Kelly Cole is that she has a great first name, don't you think, Bobby? I agree, I agree. <laughs> but really, Kelly Cole is a coaching veteran with more than two decades of experience. She spent the last two seasons as an assistant at Harvard in addition to nine at Boston College and 11 at their alma mater Northwestern. She's made 11 trips to the postseason, including eight NCAA tournament berths and three Sweet 16 appearances. Coach Cole will be putting the pieces together this season, but expect the Huskies to bring excitement in an up-tempo style every night. You'll see them run up and down the court and cause some chaos, but at the end of the day, it's about ex execution and good decision making. That will be the key to a successful season. The Huskies were picked seventh in the preseason poll. Coach Cole does benefit in her first year, inheriting a lot of upperclassmen that include three seniors and six juniors, one of those standouts being Elise Mark. Elise Mark was one of the more consistent Huskies last season. She battled injury midway through the season but still turned in more than 15 points per game and earned all CAA honors. She's definitely an impact player for this Northeastern team. Senior Immensi Mercier is back and ready to finish her career on a high note. She's done a little bit of everything for the Huskies. She was among the league leaders in assists last season, dishing out four a game. She can also create her own opportunities, averaging more than eight points a game last year and on the defensive end, she had 46 steals. Down low will be junior Samantha DeFries. She was third on the team in scoring as a sophomore, posting nine points per game. She was tough on the glass as well, averaging more than seven a, a game. Coach Cole at Media Day talking about her upperclassmen. Yeah, I think we've got fantastic um, senior leadership, upper-class leadership. We've got six juniors um, to go along with our three seniors. Uh, and as a, as a whole, they have been fantastic um, uh, Eager to eager to learn. Um, you know, you never know as a as a new coach going in, uh, the kind of resistance or questioning or things like that that are going to happen. I, I think this entire team, including those two, have been um, I, better than I could have expected as far as just eager to learn and, and willing to do whatever it was that we're asking them to do. So changes, that, you know, they're like, yes, coach, how high, coach, how fast, coach, <laughs> that kind of thing. So they've been they've been fantastic. 
The women's team will open up the 2014-15 season at home on Friday afternoon at noon, November the 14th, as they host rival Boston University, while the men will also open with the Terriers at TD Garden, home of the Celtics, Sunday, November the 16th at 1230. You can see that contest live on Nesson. Fans, don't forget about our coaches' one-on-one -on -one features as you, Bobby, and former head coach Blaine Taylor sat down with Coach Cole and Coach Cohen at Media Day. You can watch them now on both the CAA men's and women's basketball blogs, Hoop Scoop and Baseline Buzz. CA Hoops Weekly Season Preview presented by Under Armour continues on Wednesday as Rob, Kelly, and I break down the Towson Tigers. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you tomorrow.